back to Aspire the Simple Life, Janelle's Life Blog. And today we are going to basically do a mango salad because it is getting to that season. And one of those salad dressings that I like to put on there is this one that I came across several years ago. It's actually made by um, Gerard's. But the thing about it is, is that there's only like one place in town that has it. They used to have it everywhere and now they don't. So instead of going to the store and getting that, I decided that it would be a good idea if we decided to make it. So one of those things that you're going to need is some white balsamic vinegar. And it is a product of Italy, which is a great thing. And then also we're going to use some olive oil. And if I can get it open, maybe I should have done this before. All right, we are going to pour this into a blender. Let's taste it too. Very nice. Trying to do about a cup here of balsamic vinegar. And our trusty olive oil. And about the same of olive oil. Because you gotta think that we're going to be using this for one whole week. And then we're going to use some citrus here. We're gonna use some, a half of a lemon. The other half of the lemon is going to go on our salad, which the salad, everything is all chopped up. Except for the chicken. Here is some honey. And then we're gonna put a little bit of salt in. Usually I'd probably try to put some coarse black pepper in here, but I don't have any, so we're just gonna use a little salt here. Try to do a little salty sweet action. And then of course, we're going to put our lid on top and give it a little shake on here. <laughs> That's perfect. 
take this, put it in a mansion drawer, and your salad grass and dressing is all ready to go for your lunches. Of course, shake it up in before you decide to, of course, use it. And then dropping down below over here. I'm getting all of my pieces of chicken ready to go for my meal prep this week. And I, this usually has strawberries in it too. I just didn't pick them up. This time I was going simple. And also cheap because all of this stuff gets quite expensive. Have your chicken ready to go too. This already has my lemon juice and my mango on top of it. So we're going to put this into each of the bowls. We're also going to use some of my dried cherries that I have already gotten ready and stick those on top of everything. And the lemon juice will help prevent the salad from going bad for too long. <clears throat> and this will last a week in the refrigerator. So about four days.
then like I said, if it separates like it's already starting to do, um, just shake it up before you use it. You can always, you know, put your black pepper in here too because that's what gives it the pepper look. And I have three mangoes left over. So I hope you guys like this video and uh, stay tuned for more great recipes. If you guys have a recipe, email me at the um, Food Aspire Home and Garden LLC email address and leave me a story and I'll be able to um, showcase one of your guys' salads on or one of your recipes or whatever on our video. So I hope you guys inspire to use something wonderful in your life no matter what it is and inspire other people to do something wonderful in theirs. And guess what guys? Coming soon on Thursdays we are going to be starting this next Thursday. I believe it's the 11th or the 12th. We will be starting at 7 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. That's Colorado time. Um to do live videos. So if you guys are interested, come on and bring some questions or some comments or whatever so that we can get back to you. If you want to email me at the Food Aspire email address at Food Aspire Aspire, let's see, Food Aspire Home and Garden LLC at gmail.com and we can get back to you with all the questions or leave questions down below or what have you and we'll try to get back to you on that too. So I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. Don't work too hard, but I know you will. And we'll see you next time on Aspire, The Simple Life, Janelle's Life Blog.